Now, traditionally, the international tourism industry has profited thanks to higher disposable income of older travellers. Now, but increasingly, tech-savvy millennials are seen as a key market for those travel funds. Tanya Beckett's been finding out more at the ITB Travel Show. It's in Berlin. One trend very evident here at the International Travel Show in Berlin is that although young people may not spend terribly much when they travel, they are travelling more. And the budget end of the market is becoming much more creative and, of course, comfortable. So this camper van sleeps four people. And if I slide out in this direction, there's a shower. There is, in fact, a sink. And if I can just wedge myself into the daylight of the kitchen, I hope Patricia's got the kettle on here. It's breakfast time. You're the marketing manager nice for Indie you. Campers, uh, Patricia and Barris. Um, tell me, older people also are interested in this experience. Why are they attracted to it? Well, we're, um, we're very excited to see that also the elderly are looking into this kind of uh, travel. Largely because it's, it's a very different type of experience. It's about uh, adventure, it's about exploring, being free, having full flexibility to travel and stop wherever you may. And um, the fact that you really don't need to take into account hotels, um, rental cars, trying to figure out all your accommodation and all the planning on the way. This is being spontaneous and being independent. And of course, it only costs about a dozen euros a day if you get four people in this van. That's a pretty cheap accommodation option. Absolutely. So we want more and more people to have access to travel, to discover, to explore. And that's why we're trying to, to appeal to smarter budgets. And you give them advice on where to go and what to do. Yeah. We have a great team that uh, we all lived, traveled in a lot of places, so we have real authentic local knowledge that we're always sharing with all of our customers. It's the service that makes a difference. Patricia, thank you very much indeed. So much emphasis here on the luxury end of the market, but perhaps this is actually the future. Tanya Beckett, there. Still